Which assets go into my trust? You can place into your trust a bank account, a brokerage account, a piece of real property, a house, a condominium, a co-op, sometimes. Anything with a certificate of ownership, such as stocks, bonds, LLCs, corporations, items that you have of a certain financial, I don't want to get too technical. <laughs> Did I forget the words? No, no. I didn't. You can place a multitude, aha, big word, a multitude of assets into your trust. It's both a revocable trust and an irrevocable trust. You don't want to put things like uh, a liability such as a vehicle or a motorcycle. A motorcycle is a vehicle, a car, a plane, a helicopter. Don't place those things into it. Now, I'm in New York, and in New York, we would not place retirement accounts into the trust. So that's a 401k, IRA, and then we have a number of city agencies and departments that have their own lettered uh, retirement accounts. If you want those assets to go into the trust, it would be upon the passing of the person. So upon my death, I have a beneficiary, uh, my wife or my children or a friend, or typically children and spouses, but it could be anyone. It could be a, a niece or a nephew or a, an unrelated person who govern the retirement accounts by beneficiary designations, and you can place the name of your trust as the beneficiary of the retirement. And that's how uh, you would do it. And that's what goes in. And if you need more, frankbrunolaw.com. I try to be both accessible and friendly and informative. And I hope I succeeded. And I know I did. Thank you.